Hi everybody. When I was looking at the comments that were left on the exit ticket, I noticed that there were a number of people who said that they wanted to get more practice with soft chalk. So I just wanted to let you know quickly that you can redo so any soft chalk lesson as many times as you want. Whatever, your, whatever score you get, Canvas will only record the highest one. So, a problem that I've seen happen a lot over the years is that people miss answering questions because they didn't realize how to access them. So let me show you here with the theoretical perspectives. This is the first slide of the um, the soft chalk lesson for the for the current module. When we scroll down to the bottom, the first type of activity that we have is a drag and drop. So I can assure you the answers in Canvas are correct. Even if I line this up perfectly, if it's the wrong answer, then it's not going to let me leave the answer leave the answer in that space. Okay, so it will only let you drop an answer in the correct location. That means that if it's not letting you drop it there, go back and review the information. There's something there that you missed or did not quite understand or sent me a message and asked me to explain something to you more or differently. So that's the first type is the drag and drop and notice it has a restart button so you can click it and redo that set. So we go to the next page we read through the information and when we get down to the bottom in small letters we see quiz group and an arrow. We need to click on quiz group for the questions to appear. This one's a multiple choice so you'll answer the question and it also tells you it's the first of two questions so make sure you click next so you can get to the second question and then answer that one. If you click next again it's going to say the quiz is complete going to the next page. Once again we read through, we scroll to the bottom, it's a drag and drop, so it's a matching there. Not going to work because I picked the wrong one. Click on the next. Symbolic interactionist theory here. Self-check. If it's not already showing you the question here, click on self check in the arrow to make the question appear and once you've chosen your answer you can click on check answer to find out if you were right or wrong. When you get to the last slide once again summary just a couple of sentences but there is another quiz group. If we look down here well, we can check our answers. In this case, we're just going to be able to scroll through and see all three questions displayed, and then you can check your answers. At this point, we can check the score. It says that I have scored 0 out of 14 because I haven't done a thing. You, however, should see a finish button or something along those lines so that you can click on that and your score will be automatically recorded in Canvas. If for some reason you don't get that finish or end button, then just take this right here as a screenshot using your computer so that it shows me which soft chalk lesson. Down here it'll show me what date and time you took it and your final score. So that's it. If you have any questions or problems, let me know. Those are the places to look for the questions so that you can get those minimum scores you need in order to make it through the module. Take care.